guys, I'm coming to you Saturday after my long run, my 20 miler that I did on the treadmill right there. And the reason for that, you will see throughout the video. It was an up and down week. It was, I was all in and then I wasn't, and then I was all in and then I wasn't. So watch to see what happened. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Susie and this is I Run Things. I am training for a marathon and then another marathon and the Griffey Challenge. But the first stop is this Saturday, September 23rd at the Newport Liberty Half Marathon. So see how this week went. Good morning. Today is Sunday. I have a five mile recovery run and I'm gonna do some strength training. Now, I'm gonna be sore for the rest of the week. Guys, you know, every time I do anything strength related, I'm so forever. We'll see. And this week is also an 80 kilometer week. I think I have 51 miles. I think it's 51. It's 50, 51 miles, like pushing the 80 kilometers. So it's going to be interesting. I am excited. I'm in a really good mood. So hopefully I have a good week. Then after this, we have another combat week. So that's how Hal Hickton does it. We, you have like a super high mileage. Well, super high high mileage week and then a cut back week but you maintain that intensity in the cut back week so i like that because it gives my body the opportunity to recover a little bit so i come from week 12 which was a great week and it was a 40 mile week so we're gonna do this um yeah i'm gonna start because the video started so i'm gonna start warming up Okay, so I ran on the treadmill five miles, average 12, 13, I think. Very easy. My heart rate was like 138 average, which is phenomenal for me. And I credit all this to drinking this much water. And my heart rate overnight dropped again a couple of um, beats per minute. So I am super, super happy with this, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna continue drinking. I have like half of this. So I guess I drank 60 ounces already. Yeah, I'm gonna take a shower and have lunch because I deserved it. It's 12 right now, 11.55 to be exact. So yeah, and I have um, stuff to do around the house today. I need to clean, vacuum, sort clothes, wash clothes, that fun stuff. Good morning, so. I'm gonna open up this package. This company contacted me to send me um, compression socks. So I have only used compression socks once and I have to say I didn't enjoy the feeling. So this is gonna be a nice test. Oh, it's nice packaging. So the company is called Sumarpo and I think they sent Oh, look at this one. I like this color. These are blue and these are also blue. Why are they different? Hmm. Um, I don't know why the packaging is different. Okay, let's open it. I'm gonna try them on today. And this other package. Oh, this is another. This longer? No, they're the exact size as this one. So I have three pairs. This is black. Oh, these are longer. Yeah. Hmm. See the black? Are longer. And the blue ones. I don't know which ones to use. 
I'm gonna try the blue ones first. Okay, so these are pretty long. The black ones might be might be able to not put them as tight as these ones. Well, good morning. Today is Monday, beginning of the work week. Just a friendly reminder, I am filming from now moving forward. I'm film filming Sunday to Saturday. So that means the videos will go up Sunday morning instead of Monday morning as I was publishing before. It's actually raining. But we're gonna get this done. 50 minutes, tempo run. It's 10 minutes at the top, five minutes at the bottom, in between 35 minutes at tempo pace, which is like a 9.15-ish. So we're gonna do this. I feel very well hydrated. When this video comes up, I'm gonna have released already my a gallon in a day video, which so far, it's like surprising results, guys. Obviously, everything will be outlined in that one video, but surprising, surprising results. We're gonna go. We're gonna start this. I have Strength Running Podcast on my, that's what I'm listening to. And yeah, let's do it. Man, I had to stop twice to retie my shoes. They were too tight with these socks. So it's good that I'm trying this on a training run because I would have lost a couple minutes there. Oh wow, look at this. That tree just lost a lot of branches. They just fell. I'm glad no one was there. Okay, so I'm on the cool down. My legs are feel like concrete right now. Super heavy. The compression socks are helping my lower legs, but my hamstrings and glutes, quads, they're feeling pretty heavy right now. It's hard to move them. So hopefully this helps flush some lactic acid build up on my half. I have 0.2 miles left. So yeah, good. I'll fill you in on stats right after this. So 5.1 and split. I'm going to go by mile. 12.18, 9.55, 10.22. I had to tie my shoes. 9.37. And then after that, 11.04. The average is 10.39. So that wasn't as good as I thought it was. I thought I was going through it. The having to tie my shoes totally threw me off. But like I said, I'm practicing wearing these shoes with these socks. I'm going to give a try to the black ones because they seem to be taller. I'll see. Yeah, they're going to be nice, I think. Anyway, um, I'll put the link to the company and send them to me below so you guys have that in case you're interested. They look pretty badass, I would say. So I'm going to get in the house, have another cup of coffee, take a shower, and start my day. Let's do it, guys. It's only Monday. Good morning. Tuesday. Hill repeats. It's hot, but it feels like fall, if that makes any sense. It's like all the leaves are starting to kind of fall. Not all the leaves, but some. So it's so hard to keep the pace on the mile and a half that I have that warm up because I have to go super slow and it's hard. It's like a 13 minute mile pace. And again, right now I'm doing 12. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And then we have seven mile repeats, seven, woof. And then we have seven hill repeats and a mile at the tail end to cool down. So I actually shut it down. I made it shorter than it was. It was an eight mile run 
we're only gonna do six because tomorrow I am doing six with ginger and it's basically tomorrow's my rest day I'm gonna run with ginger six miles and then I'm not gonna run Sunday I'm gonna take Sunday as my rest day so, so that's the reason why but Sunday I have a five mile recovery run so because tomorrow I'm running six I'm cutting this one short that's the way that I'm gonna adjust this week's plan so yeah okay it's almost the end of the warm-up guys pretty cool but I'm still going fast okay let's get our body to the hell let's do it One done. Six more. Okay. Felt like I was running pretty fast, but I don't know. We'll see at the end. Two done. I feel like that was a bit slower, but I'm not gonna know till the end. Three. Whew. Okay. Four more. Almost halfway done which is important. Okay. Ooh. This go by fast, guys. When you break up your intervals, the workout goes like this. Okay. Yeah. Five, two left, and it's gonna rain. I can hear the thundering. So I'm gonna have to do this quick. I hope the weather lets me finish so yeah let's go okay number six was slower i think i think for a fact we'll see but i think i'm pretty sure oh i am drenched in sweat it's super muggy 20 70 degrees 22 Celsius, but it's pretty muggy. Okay. Let's get going. Okay. Seven. Done. Whew. I think that was a little bit faster. We're going to see now, guys. I'm going to do the cool down and I'll show you. Okay. Let's do it. I think the camera is dirty, but I don't have anything to clean it with. I didn't bring a t shirt today. So we have the first one, 808, 806, 830, 811, 831, 832, 808. Oh, wow. Average 1103. And I did 5.5. I thought it was better than that, guys. It wasn't that good. Well, good morning. I have my camera, but it says camera battery low, so I can't record. I'm gonna run with it just for the sake of it because I can't film anything anyway we're gonna do six miles today and um, yeah I am exhausted guys it's Wednesday and I am like so tired I don't know how I'm gonna make it to the end of the week I'm doing this run today because I can't do my run Sunday so I'm getting ahead of schedule I don't want to miss it because then I don't hit my 52 miles that I need to do this week so yeah and you have to you know that's important to hit your milestones I think I have I think I had my phone like on my face um anyway so yeah that's this could be guys maybe it will I don't know I'll try again in a minute let's 
see if it works, but I, it was charging, so I don't know what happened. Maybe it wasn't all the way in the connector. Okay, let's do this, shall we? But again, I'm so tired. We might not even get to those six, but that's what we're gonna aim for. Okay, now this is working. I don't know what happened. Anyway, I'm gonna take it very, very easy, guys. My quads are on freaking fire. I don't know why I'm having such an issue with my quads. It's always what hurts. Not hurts, what is sore. So, it's even hard to run. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay, I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays, way back a year ago. I've changed for the better this time. I thought I would never be fine. So, I stopped to do a little bit of stretching, like dynamic stretching of my hamstrings and quads and like hips. And it feels a little bit better, but man, I'm gonna have to use the massage gun a lot this week. And this is also kind of a hell. So I'm gonna do three miles up and then the other three are gonna be downhill. So that's good. <laughs> Okay, just like that, we're at six. Let's see if we can do 6.2 to round it up, to make it a 10K. Done. 6.2 in one hour eight. So, leisurely pace, 11.03 minute mile. Now, we are looking at laps. Lap 1, 11.08, and that was it. Okay, so I did the second half faster than the first one. Yes, not by much, but I did. By like a couple minutes. Okay, I'm gonna take a shower and get going with my day. My legs are concrete. They're like, I'm gonna have to use the massage gun and try and move that lactic acid off of my muscles. Okay. See you tomorrow, guys. Good morning. I'm up super bright and early. It's like 6.30. <laughs> um, I need to put 10 miles, which is not gonna happen. Oh, and it's Friday. I missed running yesterday. So I'm gonna have to run Sunday, which I was gonna take off because I have a very busy day Sunday. I'm gonna have to wake up at four in the morning to get my five miles in that I should have gotten yesterday. But that's a whole other story. Anyway, today we have 10 miles and we have to be at the vet hospital with my doggy for a checkup. They need to check a lump she has on her leg. Um, so we need to be there at nine and I need to be back in the house and showered and everything. So I'm not gonna be able to put 10 miles. I'm gonna have to split them, which is not ideal, but I'll make it happen, guys. Um, and yeah, and then tomorrow I have 20. Interesting, and I can't make them with ginger. I can put those with ginger, which would be ideal because she's in Georgia She's on vacation in Georgia. So so you're not gonna see ginger this weekend guys um, Anyway, yeah, let's get this done. I'm chilly. I'm really cold so I better start running.
half, almost seven, and I have to do three more later. I'll do them at lunchtime, hopefully it's not too hot. But if it is too hot, that's what it is. So, yeah, see you going to the club. Seven miles, 10.25 mini miles, and then, let's see, we're gonna see split. Okay, split, let's go. 11, 11, 10.42, 11.23, 10.04, 10.10, 10 10.17, and 9.05, fast lap. Very cool, guys. Okay, so. I'll do some more later, even though now it says I'm productive. Who knew? Okay, give it a shower. I did overall 10.6 in between this morning and now. I did 3.5 right now. The pace was average 10.47, which is slower than this morning. I did 10.25 this morning. You can tell my voice, I'm super tired, guys. Um, and then my aerobic was 3.3. This morning I went aerobic like 4.3, so it was like highly aerobic. Whatever, so tomorrow 20 miles, guys. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna have dinner. 6.20 right now, guys. See you tomorrow, guys. Hi, guys. It's early in the morning. Well, it's actually not that early. It's 8.25 right now. Um, sorry, I'm not looking my best. I, my GI system is completely wrecked. I went to the bathroom. This is probably too much information, but I don't know if I didn't eat something that agreed with my stomach. I don't know what it was, but I didn't have a good night. So I'm gonna do my full 20 miles on the treadmill because I am afraid of running outside and having to stop um, somewhere, not be able to control where I stop. So yeah, at least this way I can stop the treadmill and go upstairs to my own bathroom. So. Yeah, and my belly's hurting. And I need to put this 20 miler today because I can't put it tomorrow. Like I am very busy tomorrow, so I'm not gonna be able to. It's, but I, I'm like hurting. Like my stomach is hurting. This training block was going so well. And now I have this key week and it just messed up. Oh. Like I'm really hurting right now. I have my electrolytes here in my bottle. And this is for my training, my 20 mile run, because I want to attempt at fueling the way that I'm gonna be fueling for the marathon and for the half marathon six days from today. No, seven days from today. Today's Saturday, seven days from today. Sorry guys, yeah. Seven days from today, my half marathon. This is the strategy I'm gonna be using. So I have all this goose and I'm gonna use the same strategy to make sure that um, I can take as many carbohydrates as I think I should be taking. However, obviously, now that this threw a wrench in the system, I don't know how we're gonna do this, guys. That might be too much to test carb loading, you know, like carbohydrate, you know, using all these many carbs the run. I don't know. Man. That's what we're doing today. Let's go. Let's stop complaining. Okay, so 7.6 into this. I'm gonna have some root. I should have had it before. My stomach was not feeling that great. It still not feels doesn't feel that great, so I didn't want to load it. 
super early on just in case. We'll see how this sits with my belly. I'm just gonna have a half of the good. I'll leave the half for later. See how I respond to this. Okay, so I am at 15.5. I only have 4.5 to go. And I'm gonna have another go. I actually am not a person that loves who loves chocolate, but these are the ones that I kind of have left. So yeah, I'm gonna have the other half, I guess. That may be able to sustain me till the end. We shall see. So far my stomach actually I am kind of bloated, so I'm not doing well, but it's not hurting too too much. So I guess that's good, you guys. Lord, I am like sweating. I don't know if you can see it. It's bad. Okay guys, last kilometer worse. 0.6 miles. As of right now, I have 19.40. So three hours twenty-two. Be maintaining a good clip right here. Probably done this too fast. But yeah, I just want to get it done. I am so tired. Finished. We're gonna check. Okay, so 20 miles. 3 hours 27, 10 minutes 23 seconds per mile pace. So it actually was kind of right on the money. That's my pace. I tried to pick it up towards the end. I don't know if I was successful. We're gonna check now. So I'm gonna keep walking just to cool down. But let's see. Laps 11, 26, 9, 16, 12, 10, 10, 05, 9, 55, 9, 54, 9, 57, 14, 27. I walked there to take a goo and uh, drink some water. 9, 55. 9.43, 12.02, I think I drank water again there. 9.48, 10 10.41, 9.52, 9.53, 9.53, 9.47, 9.49, 9.41, and 9.24. I did the second half faster than the first half. Yay, me! Good Lord, I'm exhausted though. I think it probably lost four pounds of water in sweat. Anyway, I need to take a shower. I think I have walked enough. I'm gonna take a shower. Let me turn this off. Oof. I look and feel like train ran over me, you guys. So, yeah, I had two goose only. I was planning on having more. My summer was not feeling it, so yeah. Okay, look at all this sweat. Well, I don't know that you can see it. Let me see if I can find more light. So, maybe here. Well, this is all wet. It's all, that's why you don't see anything. It's all wet. And then, I don't know. These pants actually don't show the wetness. They don't show the sweat, but I am like, yeah, drenched. So, I'm gonna call it a day, take a shower, and this video is gonna go up tomorrow, Sunday. And then there's another video coming out Thursday, guys. I hope you stick around for that one. If you have any questions about this training block, post them below. And also, next week, next Saturday, I am going to be running the Newport Liberty Half Marathon. So if you are there, this video is going to go up Sunday. So if you're there, leave a comment below. Let me know. I'll be there. Say hello if you see me. So I love meeting you guys. So, yeah. As always, you can click here on my face and subscribe and watch two other videos right here. Run fearless. Bing.